Hey guys, this is Martha with Valley Market Real Estate and I am going to do the market memo for Marty this week. I did it last this same week last year as well uh, and I did it in my car because it was so windy that week. Uh, There's no way I could get good audio. This year I'm doing it from my home office because it is so freezing cold. I think it's still 10 below at my house. Uh, I didn't feel like bundling up and going outside to do it. So it's a little peek into my home office here. And I also mentioned last year, uh, just a little reminder to shop local for the holidays with Black Friday coming up. That's, that's on my mind. It's on my mind again this year. So I'm not going to go on a five minute rant like I did last year, but do please try to shop local. Even if it's one gift this year, uh, maybe you have a goal to get all of your gifts locally. That would be just amazing. And I really commend you for that if that's the case. And if you are stuck for ideas of where to go, shoot me an email, martha at valleymarket.com. I have lots of suggestions for you. So just want to throw that out there uh, with Black Friday coming up this week. But let's get into the numbers. So we had 27 new houses hit the market last week. We had 36 pending, which I believe is the same as the week before. So again, more pendings than new listings, which is going to make our total inventory drop. We closed out 34 houses and our total inventory is at 276, which is quite low as we keep saying over and over again. Uh, based on that average price of our total inventory, I would say that a lot of those are probably new construction and to be built. So I think it's safe to assume that there's even less than 276 houses that are finished and ready to be moved into today. Uh, total pending, 499, and there are two foreclosures on the market. So compared to last year, I have it pulled up. Last year, this week, we had 28 new listings, 30 pendings, 37 closed. So that's all really similar. Uh, last year, our inventory was low too, but last year we had 295 total inventory. So we have about 20 fewer houses same week. Uh, this year compared to last year, we have 20 fewer houses. So even smaller inventory. So what does that mean? Well, if you are thinking about selling, if you need to sell, consider doing it now. Consider the winter months. It's a little uh, less common in Alaska to list your home in the winter. I know people don't like to move in the winter, but consider the fact that you'll have less competition. You may be able to make a little more money on your house and there are buyers out there looking who are gonna be thankful that you're listing your house in the winter because they're ready to buy. So if you're curious what your house is worth, you need to sell, just send any of the people on this email. Marty's gonna list our emails below. Send us an email, give us a call, shoot us a text. We'd love to help you. We'll do a comparative market analysis and see what the market value for your house is. And if you're a buyer and you need help navigating this crazy market, let us know. We're ready to help you and we'll try and get you into one of these 276 houses. We know how to get you an offer that a seller won't be able to refuse. So that's all I have for this week. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next week. Thanks, Martha. I appreciate it. And remember what she said about shopping local this year. John hasn't sent us any new snow machine videos, so I'm going to have to use last year's, but we better start using ones with snow in them since it's that time of year. Take a look at these people here. Each one of them can help you out. They know the market. They know the area. Just give them a call. You can dial their number, or you can text the same number, or you can email them. If you email them, just type in their first name, like Jennifer at valleymarket.com. So John at valleymarket.com, Bruce at valleymarket.com, and so on. Get a hold of somebody. They'll help you out. We all know the market. Most of these people are born and raised right around here, so they know this area really well. Okay. Talk to you next week.